Today, I wanna to show you how you can set up and measure your hook rate inside Facebook Ad Manager. So once you're inside your Facebook Ad Manager, you need to simply click on the Columns section, go down to Customize Columns, and then here you need to create a custom metric. You can already see that I have a few custom metrics set up, but we're just gonna do hook rate again for the purpose of this video. So we click on Create Custom Metric, and here we can put in a formula. However, before we do that, we wanna make sure that we change the format to percentage and we just want to name it so i'm going to call this hook rate 2 because i already have one set up you can describe your metric here so you can remember what it does and now it's time to add in the formula so the formula for the hook rate is your three second video plays so you just select that and we want to divide that by the impressions so we just start typing impressions and it comes up and then that is the formula that it's going to run to create your custom metric once you've done that you can decide who wants to be able to access this custom metric so if you're on a team of people you can make sure that everyone on your team has access i'm just going to click only me for the purpose of this and then you just simply create your custom metric and it's done. And now in order to view this inside your ads manager, all you need to do is tick it within the customized column section, click apply, and then that will apply it to the end of your columns and you'll be able to view your hook rate. I actually made a video about hook rates, what makes a good hook rate, what makes a bad hook rate, and you can view that one in the cards above. But until next time, thanks very much for watching. If you enjoy this video and find it useful, then make sure that you like it and leave a comment and subscribe for more videos about marketing and creative.